everyone! My name is Michaela, and I work at the St. Albert Public Library and I'm here today to tell you all about some great books that I've chosen just for grade threes. So the first book I'd like to tell you about is called Because of the Rabbit by Cynthia Lord and it's about Emma who's been homeschooled for her whole life but this year she's going to a real school. Now this is pretty exciting but Emma is also feeling really nervous because she doesn't know if she's going to make any friends. But when she gets to school, she meets a boy in her class named Jack, who has autism. And when Jack finds out that Emma has a foster rabbit at home, he gets really excited and they start to spend lots of time together. But making friends is hard and keeping them can be even harder. And Emma still has a lot to learn about how to be a good friend. The next book I'd like to tell you about is called Sky Chasers and it's by Emma Carroll. Now Sky Chasers is set in 1793 before there was planes or anything that could fly. And it's about a girl named Magpie who accidentally gets swept up in one of the first semi-successful hot air balloon test flights. Now, flying attached to a large balloon is exhilarating and terrifying, but Magpie decides that she's going to stay with the Mopolki family and help them with their hot air balloon experiments. But when the King of France finds out that their experiments are almost ready, he insists that they need to come to the castle and show him their flying machine. But this sends Magpie and the Montgolfiers into a panic because the machine is not ready yet. Will they be able to finish it in time to show the king? And if they do, who will ride in the hot air balloon? Now the last book I'd like to tell you about is called Dragons in a Bag by Zeta Elliot. And if you like to read about magic and adventure, this is the perfect book for you. It's about nine-year-old Jackson who is sent to spend the day with a mysterious distant relative named Ma. But when he gets to Ma's house, things are a little bit strange. There's a mysterious box on the table that Jackson is sure he saw move by itself. And after a little bit of investigating, he realizes that Ma is a witch. Join Jackson and Ma as they travel through space and time and meet all sorts of crazy creatures like invisible men, talking animals, and dinosaurs, as they try and deliver the dragons in a bag. Now, I have lots more books that I picked out for grade threes that I wasn't able to talk about today, but I will put the full list up at the end of this video so you can take a picture of it and check them all out of the library. On this list, you'll see that some of the books say library, and some of them say Libby or Hoopla. Now, if it says library, that means that you can put it on hold and then go and pick it up at the library, but if it says Libby or Hoopla beside it, that means that it's a book that you can borrow on your device. And you just go to the library website and you can download it onto a phone, an iPad, or a computer. Now you can also go to our website and find a link for a personalized book list. So if you want book suggestions just for you, you can fill out the form that we have, tell us what you like and what you don't like, and then we'll send a list back to you of books that we think you're going to love. Now you can find this on our website at s apl.ca. The other thing that you can find on our website is information about our upcoming summer reading game. This year it's going to be a lot of fun and it's called Escape from the Labyrinth. I hope you all have a great summer and you get lots of summer reading done. Bye everyone!